Okay, we are going to solve problem, practice problem 3.1 from Sadiku book. So the question is obtain the node voltage. So we have two node voltage here, node 1 and node 2. And here is the ground on the bottom of the circuit. So at the ground, the voltage here will be 0. And let's start at node 1. So at node 1, let's write at node 1. At not one. Okay, so the current that goes in is equal to the current that goes out. So I will assume that the current is going there and then split into two with this direction. So the current that goes in is only this current. So that current is 3 ampere. And then the current that goes out is this one and that one. <laughs> so the current that going to the bottom. We have this equal to V1 minus 0 divided by 2 because of Ohm law, because of Ohm's law. And then this current that going to the right is V1 minus V2 divided by the value of this resistor. It's 6. And now we can multiply both sides by 6 so we will have 18 is equal to 3 v1 plus v1 minus v2 and then we can simplify this as 4 v1 minus v2 is equal to 18 okay let's have this as equation number one and now we move on to note number two Let's see what we get at node number 2. So the current that goes out is here because this current source is going down and I will assume this going down also. So according to KCL at node 2, the current that goes in is equal to the current that goes out. The current that goes in is only this current and that will equal to V1 minus v2 divided by 6 and that equal to the current that goes out this current v2 minus v0 minus 0 divided by 7 so v2 minus 7 and this current is 12 ampere okay now what can we do here we can multiply this by 42, I think. Yeah, 42. Okay. So we will have 7 V1 minus 7 V2 is equal to 6 V2 plus and then it's 12 multiplied by 42 so i will need my calculator here 12 multiplied by 42 500 0 500 not 500 0 504 and we can move this to the left hand side so we will have 7 v1 minus 13 v2 is equal to 504 okay we have now two equation with two variables so we can solve this by using elimination let's do that so i will have this equation equation number two 7 v1 minus 13 v2 is equal to 500 4. this is equation 2 and then I will multiply this equation 1 by 13 so we will get 13 v2 and they will eliminate each other so let's do that and that makes this 4 multiplied by 13 is 52 yeah v1 minus 13 v2 and that will equal to 18 multiplied by 13 
So we'll have two, three, four. And we have this. So we can subtract this. Okay, now we will have 7 minus 52 minus 45 V1 and this will cancel each other and then that one that is 270 and we will have V1 is 270 divided by 45 and that is minus 6 volt so v1 is minus 6 volt and from this we can calculate v2 by substituting this into equation number one so we will have 4 minus 6 4 multiplied by minus 6 minus v2 is equal to 18 and we will have minus 24 minus V2 is equal to 18 and okay we can manipulate this minus 24 minus 18 is equal to V2 and then it is minus 42 I think yeah but just to be sure yeah minus 42 minus 42 is V2 or V2 is equal to minus 42 volt. So the not voltages is V1, V1 here, V1 is minus 6 volt, and V2, V2 is minus 42 volt. Okay, so this is the final answer of practice problem 3.1. Okay, let me know if I made any mistakes in the calculation in the comment and don't forget to like and subscribe the channel. Thank you for watching.